And oh gosh. Uh, mid. Should we do mid or jungle? Mid or jungle. He's laughing. Why you laugh, James Penn? Why you laugh? Don't laugh. He'll take support. Axamundi, champion of Earth. Hello. Hello. So Thanto's automatically banned, which is a shame. Which is a shame. Let's see. Troll. Troll. I lose every game. Every game. Every game. Alright, they got Kronos banned. There's Bakasura banned. We can do... I can do mid. I can do jungle. I can do ranged. It doesn't really matter. I don't really know. Uh, so, let's see. We'll go back up. We got Solo on Axiom. He's going to play support, actually. James hasn't picked anything. Now there's Osmos. He's going to go for a low key. So, Solo? Jungle or Solo? He's going to play low key. He can Bacchus. Uh, we can grab the Bacchus. We can grab the Bach. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm just going to grab mid, because it's available. Uh, we can go for Agni, we can go for Zhang Kui. Uh, I did recently play a Zhang Kui game. We can do an Agni. Agni, Poseidon, vote now. Zhang Kui. Zhang Kui. I can't do Kronos, unfortunately, because Kronos is banned. Cannot do. Al Kuang. Dude, we can do an Al Kuang. That's what we can do. Noodle. Why do we always forget about the noodle? How is it you go through life forgetting about noodles? <laughs> You know, just lock it in, okay? Just, just do it. I'm just gonna pick it, cause this new Q means that people don't have things to pick and stuff, and people won't be able to like stuff and thing. You know? I hate it. I hate it when that stuff does thing. Here's what we can do, though. We can totally just like I don't, I don't have Bastet mastered, guys. Oh no. Oh, I don't have Bastet mastered. It's the worst ever. I guess I can't. I guess I can't. I wish I could, but I can't. Fortunately. Unfortunately. Why are we getting Zhang? Zhang for solo? Okay, she's for solo. Okay. Okay. We lock it in. There's Thor. They got Cupid as their ranged, which means Neath is on the table. Neath Apollo. Neath. Global alt to strunk. Especially mid lane. Especially mid lane. Ah, right, what we got? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got an alcohol. We got an alcohol. I didn't say anything fingered. You were jungle? Why would you finger the oh he figured. He figured. He didn't finger the jungle. He figured. Alright. Okay, that's not the one you need to correct, but that's not the one. <laughs> it's not the one you need to correct. <laughs> Alright. Alright, what should we play? Should we play regular noodle? Should we play steamed noodle? Or should we play stuffed noodle? Jalapeno pepper noodle. It's more like a habanero, given the color. But who knows? Who knows? Steamed noodle? Steamed noodle. Stuffed noodle? Steamed noodle? They want the steamed noodle is what they want. Stuffed noodle, steamed noodle. Stuffed, steamed, stuffed, stuffed, steamed. The choices. The choices are endless. Make your choice now. Speak it out loud to your monitor. Speak it out loud to your monitor and I'll hear it. I'll feel it. I'll feel it in my loins and I'll be able to tally it there and decide. Build to decide. Oh no. It's ticking down. It's ticking down. What's it gonna be? Oh, it looks like it's stuffed noodle. It looks like stuffed noodle. Stuffed noodle has win. The the votes are in from my loins. It's gonna be stuffed noodle for the day. We're gonna be playing Al Kwong up against a Hebo most likely. Pretty easy for Al Kwong. I mean Hebo's all about the control through harassment and Al Kuang's all about the I can sit in my tower and do whatever I want because I'm Al Kuang and I have lots of push and I just hang out and do whatever. Um, so it looks like, oh, Thermite Monkey's on there. I am ready 
Fender in the jungle, so that Cupid, Hebo. This could be a good game for us. We'll see. This could be a good game for us. We shall see. We shall see. Uh, so my goal here is going to get as much farm as I can, as quickly as I can. It's pretty much the goal you always have, but more so on characters like Alquan, where your early game is not really the biggest thing you have going for you. I'm actually going to go for my old build, which doesn't work so much anymore, but we're still going to do it because I like it. I like it a lot. So I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up book right away. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and sit in the lane and just farm, farm, farm. Now, this is not as effective as it used to be just because the, the jungle ganks are so uh, prevalent. But with Ao Kuang, you have to play very passively. And eventually, if you get it, your your transition from laning phase to mid game is incredibly powerful. And given the fact that this is a ranked game, I'm just going to play this by the book. I'm going to sit... I That was an accident. That was a total accident. I did not mean to put that pun there. That, that, that pun was not completely accidental. I, okay. I want to play this one standard because <laughs> I, this is a ranked game and I don't want to lose anything. Uh, so we're going to just sit in the mid lane. We're going to farm it up. We're going to push it up and play very, very safe. We don't really want to lose anything early on. Uh, give away a kill or possibly anything like that. Um, once we invade blue, we can. They have a pretty strong level one, but we do as well. We actually both have pretty uh, strong level ones. Uh, we're going to hang out through the side camp. Again, I mean, you really want to take anything too risky. I can go for my two or my one if I get into trouble. The slow would benefit me a lot. I don't really want to get rotated on. They can ro they can invade from all directions. Um, I think a few people on the enemy team are, uh, f like, they're fans of the stream, but I don't know if they're going to be watching it. Uh, you always got to keep that in mind, but, you know, always err on the side of caution, but I don't think anyone would. Thermite never would. He'd, he probably closed it and muted it by now. We're just going to go for the, the uh, tornado since everything's good. Everything's golden. I'm going to clear that out. Good luck. What we can do is come into the mid lane and try to go for a good split on this. I should get two of them. That's going to cook. It's basically uh, going to sit on top of the entire wave and front that up. I might need some help there. There's that. They're going to go for the damage. Boof. It looks like it hasn't fallen yet. Are they having troubles? They should be about to get it, really. And there it is. Okay. So this guy is going to hang out. Still going to get old experience from that. Again, I'm going to cook it a bit. Basically, just going to do as much damage as I can. And since I'm going book, I'm up against the Hebo. My whole job here is to stay alive as long as I can and not really give anything away. Uh, once you, you know, level 2 on your tornado, everything starts to get much, much easier. He's just going to hit the tower a little bit. I don't really care about that too much. It's fine. I'm really more uh, about the experience right now. Once I get that, all will be well in the world. We're going to place that right about there. That should hit the melee and also the range. The range are going to stop early. Which is unfortunate, but the melee will end up dying. That one ranged will die. There's that farm up there. And we're going to hang back far enough that we're safe, but close enough that we'll still get experience when the minions die. And that's the whole benefit. Again, keep in mind that Fenrir is the jungler. He does have... The ability to jump in, do lots of damage, lots of, uh, you know, control and damage. The stun from the Unchained jumps out. Um, and once they had that reaction, he was just going to burst me down. Especially the fact that I don't have boots or really any items that have HP early on. Looks like they might be going for the side camp pretty early there. And indeed, they will be. Looks like they just got it already. Don't really have any slows to boot. Make sure we get that secured, and we do. Pop my mana pot, mid tower getting pushed. Fenrir is here, but who really cares? He's a little bit light to the party. Mid camp yet again. Medium. Those will all die. Loki Sears. Fenrir's on the right side jungle, so we're going to tell my team Fenrir right side, side jungle. Loki's gonna try to grab me. He should be at blue right now. He might be. He's not at blue. He might be at the medium camp where he went home. No, he is. He just got uh, away from the blue. So that's good. That's gonna be all farmed up. We're still hanging out here. Don't really know. He probably just went home. He went over to the side uh, just to go home. 
Make sure I just don't know where he is at all times. So back to him, he does hand of the gods. He does, so he's probably going to be grabbing that side camp. It's about to respawn pretty soon here. Basically just going to grab that. And do the movement speed buff. Left side camp is available. I can throw this down on top of the fender when he tries to do it. Subic's doing it, which is fine. He's gonna do damage. He's gonna hit both of them, which is good. Very limited damage right now. Book is not a great starting item, but once you finish it off and you'll survive. If you don't die with the book and you start getting his stacks up, it's gonna be incredibly powerful. Start getting this. Uh, start getting this cooked up. And by cooking, I mean of course you leave them inside the tornado, so they just get a longer duration on it. I should start clearing that out. They're going to get the right side. Honestly, oh, Fender's not here, so that's good. He looks like he got it. Enemy missing metal. Left side, Fender's going to go in. We might get a little... Might be to death. Ah, the Neath. Bacchus ended up dying, which is unfortunate. Sobek dead. Traded Bacchus for Sobek. Not only the worst of deals. Ebo getting some farm guaranteed. He actually has a lot more experience than I have just because they're getting those side camps. What I can do is I can wait for this to push up and then go to that side camp that's behind me since Loki's not there. You can substitute it for the camps that you're not getting. There's a water spout. Fenner's here. I don't have any way to avoid the Fenner ultimate. There's a kill. Good pick. Very, very good pick. So Loki seems like he's invading. I think there's not enough invades in uh, Smite as it is. It's very easy. I'm gonna pick this up here. So I'm also at the point where I'm gonna finish off tier three book right away. This is exactly what I plan to do with this build. I pick up the book and then five mana potions. And if you only cast tornadoes and sit in lane, there isn't there really isn't anything that anyone can do about it to stop you, besides killing you, of course. This wave will get pushed down. There goes a the kill on that. We're just about enough. Enemy missing. Enemy missing That's going to get cleared out. One more wave. We'll have enough to go back, finish off the book, start stacking it up, and then I'll go right into boots, Incoming some CDR, black. and then we'll be in a good spot. Damage buff is up and available. This side can't looks like it's up here as well. It's unfortunate. I figured he would ult right away, so I don't want to just drop my ult and force him to dash away. Looks like they got killed there on the knee. This is actually going to push through. Hopefully it landed. It looks like it did. That's going to cut the Benjamins. And then we can head back. Fender has yet to show up. Hebo will be heading home. I'm going to get the last little bit there. And we good to go. So I'm going to sell that. I'm going to sell that. And I'm going to sell one more. And then we're going to get enough for an Aegis, which is going to help me with the Hebo ultimate, but as well as the Fenrir ultimate. And any kind of burst damage that comes out. And possibly allow me to pop my Aegis, pop my ultimate. I'm going to avoid that. Uh, what some people will do, and some people will often do, is they go for Fist of the Gods, Blink on uh, Alquang. At this point, with how much aggression they have with the Hercules, the Cupid, Fender, Hebo, Sobek, they have enough tools to pull me out of a bad situation, or of a good situation, um, and kind of get, get me caught out in a situation that I wouldn't want to normally be in. So I really don't want to have that happen, especially since this is a solo queue. I'm just going to go post, play it safe. Go for Aegis. Do my dirt. There's that. They fighting over here. Fender's going to pick him up. Does he have enough to survive? He will not. Hebo actually rotated over before coming back to the lane. And we're not really going to do anything about that. Subek went to the left side. Loki hanging out right now. So we're 2 4 and 2. But we're not that far, far behind in gold. We're about 800 gold behind, which could be worse. There's the Hebo. This whole wave's going to die. Subek looks like he's doing this just by the fact that Hebo is kind of running around. It looks like they are indeed. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Okay. Animation, sound, and nothing. It did explode, but wasn't able to do anything there. Okay. Alright. Loki! I was baiting that really hard for the Loki to come out, but it just wasn't going to happen. Neath ultimate, Loki ultimate. They got that. Or do they? They don't. 
That Loki really need to jump off the camp and come sooner. Your left tower is under attack. Like I really needed them to get off that camp as soon as possible. Just so I didn't have to take so much damage there. That's why I was baiting it out. Is I wanted him to just jump off the camp and come into mid lane. I figured he would, but he ended up not doing it. He used each hammer to avoid the burst damage from the ultimate, just in case he caught me at the very edge of it, which would have been uh, regrettable, very unfortunate. Um, but uh, at this point, we're doing okay. We haven't given away anything. We're farming quite effectively. In fact, we're caught up to everyone except for Cupid, who's 2 and 1 in the left lane, which is definitely a big pickup for him. And of course, once we get the stacks up on our book. We'll have tons of tons of damage. And at this point, it has been completely unpunished. Fenrir actually hasn't ganked at all, so I'm going to benefit a lot from this. This is unfortunate. I'm dead. That's unfortunate. We got the Fenrir snipe at the very end there, which is good. Fenrir kind of brought me out of tower there, Sobek. I kind of went for it just because I thought I could kill the Fenrir, and I knew I could kill the Fenrir, but the Sobek was a little bit too much for me to be able to deal with. Um, just because they're, they're going to be quite aggressive, I actually will triple link this game. Um, I, think, I think I actually won't need to teleport here. We should be okay without the teleports that just got cleared off the tower. They're gonna kill the Neath. He ended up dying, which is great. Um, so right now we're at two, two, we're about a thousand gold behind. Could be worse, could be better. Herky's in the right lane, gonna push that up himself. We're four and six. Our Neath is far behind, which is regrettable. Loki's two and zero, but he's, he's not really keeping up in the experience department, which could be worse. I mean, Loki really needs the farm more than anything else. Is that stack there. People doing work right now. Oh my. Push or rotate. Like those towers should be completely pushed. John Quake going for a kill in the right lane. Be careful left. If anyone ever leaves your lane to gank, you need to follow them to the gank or you need to push your lane. Either get a tower or even up the odds in the lane that's getting ganked. You can't do neither because um, you'll end up leaving a situation where your teammates are getting outnumbered and getting picked off and you're really uh, not getting a tower from it at all. Fender is here. Fender a little bit under farmed at this point. The wave's coming out. See if I can get some golden experience from this. Looks like they will. I won't get the gold. That's fine. Left side cap may or may not be open. There's a blink. There's that. Just to see if there's anything there. Got level 3 of my ultimate. Left side lane's pushing up. Still 4 and 6. We're actually starting to, starting to slightly fall behind in the gold department just because... Um, or the gap's getting bigger, I should say. People kind of pressuring this as hard as he possibly can. People heading over that Be way. Right Be careful, right. Take left lane. Take left lane. A mighty fall. That tower is going down slow. Hebo could be here. I don't want to get caught by that. Take middle lane. And we have an ultimate. He probably has a ward. Enemy missing left. Ultimate is ready. Take right lane. There's the Loki. Oh, that rotation. 
We finally got the Hercules, but we just did not have the damage we needed at all. We had way too little damage for that to happen. So we're going to go ahead and teleport back to the mid lane just because. It's getting kind of low. Push this up. There goes that. Left side. Mid camp getting pressured. I don't know why he decided to go for his ultimate instead of charging me. That would have been a better play. Keep it by himself. Left lane. Opportunity to go in there. We're not sitting pretty right now. We are not sitting pretty right now. Sorry. Be right back. Still farming up, still keeping up, still doing good. Defender's gonna go in on the Zhong. Hebo's on his way, there's Hercules, I'm gonna get out. No, I don't think Hebo is actually on his way. Definitely don't want to get caught here. It's the biggest thing. If I can keep my farm up and not give away any kills, we'll be okay. Does he have a combat blink already? He does, wow. You get that quick. Picked it up very, very quick. Right lane's gonna be pushed up. Hercules is really not not gonna die anytime soon. There's that. Push that there. Now clear the whole wave down. Hop our way down here, get this side camp. I'm basically hyper farming. Just ignoring everything. Available if I'm needed, but kind of just like AFK. Getting as much farm as I can, as quickly as I can. To the point where Alkong Tornadoes are so powerful that hey, they cannot ignore me. There's going to be that hit. Oh my god. Should be okay as far as distance goes. Retreat. For something, Subex here. There's Zonkwe. Enemies incoming. Enemies incoming. Retreat. Rotating around. Is that clear there? We go get the damage buff. They're gonna. Da that's gonna back off. So we get the damage buff right now. Uh, we should go back and finish off the combat blink. We can go for a standard blink, but I think given the situation, we'll need combat blink more. If this was a bit of a more comfortable game right now, I would go for the standard blink and possibly even Fist of the God just because the combo is so powerful. But I need to be a little bit more defensive here and make sure I live. Um, they definitely have the opportunity to pull me out, take me on a nice dinner, and never call me again. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, 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 ow. You can definitely see the power of getting book first. I mean, I have book and shoes of the Ma shoes of focus, and I have 352 magic power at 16 minutes. It's a very quick scale. Um, the book passive with the amount of mana you get, as well as your passive, everything scales so quickly for Alquang that all you really need is the book. Oh my jeez, this could be a death. I don't know if he wants it or not. Doesn't look like he does. I'm back off here. We're gonna get this because we'll need it. I'm actually gonna go for some penetration. Actually, no. We're gonna go for Gem of Isolation. It'll help my team more than anything else right now. We really need the slow. We need kill securing. We need them when they get greedy like they have been, they get punished for it. So we're gonna go for Gem right away. That'll help my team secure the kills when they get aggressive because the entire enemy team has been diving pretty hard and being, you know, very forward placing. So if we if they ever get to a point where they are, you know, aggressively placed, the gem should punish them for that by slowing them down, allowing my team to catch up and get the kill. That's all we really needed. You like rock. <laughs> 
I love that. Is that a kill? There's a kill. Here's a Sobek. Who really cares though, it's just Sobek. We'll kill this off. Get some... Oh no! So I'm just gonna back off there, gotta kill, head back to the mid lane and just keep on farming. Keep on farming. He stole away my blue buff, which was f just so painful. I really wanted that, it would have kept me out here for longer. But it's totally fine. He's gonna trade the blue buff for the life. I will always trade the, the death of Hercules for a blue buff. I think everyone is exactly the same way. Side camp, clear that out. So they might want to go into that, that lane. Mid, mid tower is going to push down. Fenner and Hebo are going to show up to defend it, interestingly enough. Fenner's is going to go over here and realize that those side camps are gone. And we're sitting good. We're sitting a lot better than we were before. And really just have to take the early game very, very carefully, very cautiously. Don't admit defeat when something bad happens. It's never really the case. All you have to do is focus up, keep farming, keep playing for that late game stage where all is well in the world. And things start to make sense again. John Quick gonna wait for a gank here. Right side tower is down. Mid tower definitely available. If we get a kill on the Hebo, we take out the mid tower, and that's gonna catapult us forward. About to cross over toward the 10,000 gold mark, which is great. Farm is up. He's gonna run into Fenner, which means the Hebo is gonna show up. John Quick's quite tanky. Let's see, Fenner's gonna go for the ulti. And slow there. Fenner's gonna be forced off the tower. So that kind of lurking. That's actually a bad place ward. Here's Hercules. Can we get him? Is the question. He's very tanky. And again, if I finish this, the gem, we'll be able to kill people like Hercules just by slowing them down the whole time. Directions there. And the gods. So if I go for this, looks like he might, might not, might, might not. Is not going to. So that's great. Basically, I ran Fender through the tornadoes and then blinked away afterwards. That he had this the damage over time effect on him. So if he went in, he'd take, be taking lots of damage. Ended up getting out there. Try to go for a risky ultimate on the Hercules. I probably could have just put it right on him, but I just wanted him to. Uh, Driving strike into it. I figured uh, Thermite's a good player. He's been playing for a long time, so I figured he'd driving strike white ring hold my ultimate, and he'd drive, driving strike right into the ultimate. Again, there's a lot of mind play that goes into using Alcon ultimate effectively. Enemy missing right. Enemy right lane. <laughs> Enemy right lane. Who's that? Bacchus on the Fenrir. Enemy incoming left. A mighty storm. And again, of course, if I had the gem right now, we'd be okay. That slow would be going down. Sobek might be going for this, if it's even up. Which it's not. I was actually surprised that he walked past it. Fenner dropping solo. They might be get a kill here. But in the meantime, Neath's caught out. Throw that out ourselves. Let's see if we can't zone him. Not gonna land it, though. That's fine. I'm gonna push this tower so the tower does fall. Looks like they're going to get into it. God, the tail was so perfectly timed. So perfectly. That was an incredible tail whip. I was actually going to eat just the end of the uh, heart bomb. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but that was a very, very good tail whip. Strong rotation. I got greedy. I got very, very greedy there. So I deserve to get punished for that. I wanted to go for a possible kill on the Hebo, who was going to back up, but didn't, uh, just because he knew something I didn't. And that information that he, that he knew that I didn't was the fact that Cupid, with a blink, um, was heading over my way. And of course, the uh, Sobek was on the way as well. 
So I did not expect a blink Cupid to come out there. I didn't think he even rotated that far. Um, so that definitely, you know, goes to show you really have to check the items, um, the, the inventories of everyone you're playing against, and really be prepared for anything that comes your way, including a blink Cupid with a heart bomb. Cupid, of course, is 5-1-1 one, one right now, fully stacked Heart Seeker, so he's doing very good. He's level 20 already. In fact, he's the uh, same level as the mid laner that I'm play pacing, uh, playing up against. They're actually still ahead by 2,000 gold. There goes a kill on the Loki. Regardless of how well we'll do, we keep falling behind, which is unfortunate. Their Cupid, Cupid is doing very, very well. Very well. Mid tower getting pressured here. That charge. That charge. A mighty fall! Your middle tower is under attack. Enemy missing metal. Retreat middle. Pull that off the mid tower. We got this damage buff. Cupid's probably gonna steal something. <coughs> interesting choice. Very interesting. We're gonna have to clear out this wave. We can't let this wave push. Be regrettable. Get away from me, get away from me. Retreat. You have slain an enemy. I really must. The mighty fall. Be right back. Be careful. Give it up. An ally has been slain. You have slain an enemy. Double kill. He must. You have slain an enemy. Triple kill. There's a slow there, so we're okay. He's gonna go for the Earthbreaker, but not gonna land in time. Mid tower's gonna go down, so we're doing really good. That was actually a really good team fight for us overall. Hercules, Hercules! And now he's gonna go for the Earthbreaker, possibly something after that, but. At this point, we're just gonna pull back, get some form, make sure we come back to the same team fight, do the exact same thing again, and we'll be okay. That. I'd rather go for the damage buff than the movement speed buff myself. That side camp would be valuable, but not at this point in time. I want the damage buff more than anything. Movement speed buff can go to the Loki. Here's a side camp. And basically just, again, just farming, 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 farming. This is really the best thing you can do in a game where you feel like you're under pressure or your team um, is kind of scattered, you can't really get everyone to group up, or you know, just general solo queue. Just farm as much as you possibly can so your presence is so overwhelming um, that they really have to uh, deal with you or end up losing the game. And that's the goal here. So you can see my farm is kind of skyrocketing. Uh, we're keeping up the damage numbers. We're going to go for penetration now because that's really what I need on players like the Sobek, the Hercules. I'm just going to get a lot of damage output on them. Kibo's on his way. So we're going to do some damage here. Box is going to jump away, which is great. Mid tower about to take some damage. I'm going to go ahead and head over that way. Your middle tower is under attack. What's that? Take left lane. Slow on the Hebo, doing some work. Charge away, spear arrow not gonna land there. That's actually gonna help his uh, mitigate wounds do lots of work. At this point, we really didn't trade that well in that last one. 
That was a tough one to engage upon. They had a really good rotation. Keeper came from behind. We didn't get a kill on that. We just don't have enough damage. So I just need to keep building as much damage as I possibly, possibly can. I'm actually going to finish off my Aegis right now. Um, it's only going to take a few seconds. We'll finish it off. Then we'll have a uh, shorter cooldown. And also have the ability to uh, reduce damage when I get out of it. Which will help for any follow-up that I get myself into. So right now we're 14, 13, 18. We're behind by about 1.2k gold just because they're farming better than us and winning team fights. The farm situation is uh, challenging, to say the least. That mid tower surviving by just a hair. Good thing that we have the, uh, the wards on. Oh, the vendor's going to go for that, without a doubt. I want to see if I can pick that up. Not going to get it in time. Subex being a jerk. So we got the cube in the left lane. That's great. This tower needs to be defended as long as I possibly can. Just so they don't have the positioning. This high camp's not up. He was mid lane. Fender's going to go left on the, f the neath. Easy pick up. Got the Fender now back out. I'm going to run into Sobek here. We're going to go our separate ways. Is he going to blink or is he just shooting over the wall? That was a good block by the Sobek. He actually blocked my squall by just dashing in front of it. We have hand. We have fist. Keep it still, keep it still. Keep it secret, keep it safe. I have my ultimate, in case we need it. And there we go. Free gold fury, damage buff, Kibo's there. Make sure that Sobek don't do anything fresh. Don't do anything fresh. Now, at this point, we're just going to need some hard damage. That's really what we're working for. Damage is the only thing that's going to save my team right now, because I'm putting out large amounts. Um, it's pretty much just me, Jean Kue, and Burst from the Loki. Neath is pretty far behind, Bacchus is pretty far behind, and playing a tank, which means the damage output is going to be primarily on me, just because the most farmed, and Alquan really does damage. That's so big. So I just need to play it safe and play as strong as I can for my team, get everything all set up and good to go. And possibly put out so much damage that we win the team fight. That's my goal right now. I have the blink, I have the Aegis, so if I get caught out, I definitely have uh, some something to lean upon. It's Hercules. that damage on the Cupid. They're going to back off of that one. That's good. And that is that. Make this quick, we have the minions here, we may as well do it. Attack fire giant. Retreat! Attack fire giant. Attack fire giant. Get the fire giant buff and we'll be doing we'll be doing good. So that was a big win for us. They actually clustered up really hard. I got a really good tornado on three of them twice. The ultimate hit the Hercules, which dropped him down, which means he could not be that that ever-present bruiser that they do so desperately needed. I still have my ultimate here. One of the reasons why I do like going shoes of focus on Al Kuang is the ultimates are are plentiful. Let's secure, secure that. That's going to zone them out. Al Kuang is very good at traffic control. Just put tornadoes in tight alleyways and force them to disengage. Hebo might go for something here. Looks like they might. They got to get away. They may not go. They may not, though. Oh, they will survive, so we're good.
We're 20 to 13 now. We're actually going to pull ahead in the gold department finally. Uh, but again, we're, we're pretty close in gold. The biggest thing for us right now is going to be this fire giant buff and defend these towers. So at this point, group up. Stay with the group. No more solo farming. We can win if you don't do anything by yourself. Okay. So this is something a lot of people will do. They'll kind of just hang out and farm something by themselves. They'll push something by themselves. Uh, you just want to stick together as much as you possibly can. As long as you possibly can. And you'll win the game. And this is something that you, you can do in your own games. If you're playing a solo game or you're playing a game where you know, you're a 2Q or 3Q. If you can convince everyone to stick together as a massive group, you will win games just because the enemy team may not be as coordinated. No benefit of lots of that. So we're going to run to their jungle here. It's a bad situation to be in. I'm actually just disengage in case they rotate. It's slow in case he doesn't get away. Subex on his way. Tornado there. Free tower. Again, staying together. No one split pushes. No one goes away. I put this ward up here in case we have rotations. We'll be able to see the flanks from behind <laughs> as we have the same exact thought. Oh, on the Fenrir, keep pushing. That right side tower is actually taking a lot of damage. This must have been a bigger wave than I expected it to be. Zone them out there. That wave coming up. greedy there. A little greedy. Let's slow off. That was very greedy play. This is actually very greedy play as well. Should not be fighting that. That is not something you should be fighting. That is not something you should be fighting. Too greedy. So the gold tree is up. They'll probably get it. We can defend it with my ultimate. I have the, the rod almost finished. What we're gonna do is we're gonna back up as soon as these are dead. We'll get the rod. We'll go get the damage buff, and then we'll try to get to the gold tree in time if they want to do it. The gold tree is absolutely valuable right now. Um, if you think otherwise, um, you're not really looking at the numbers. We're gonna see 3,000 gold difference between the two here. 3,000 gold difference between the two, and not looking too sharp. Not looking too sharp. But we're still ahead. They're actually going for the gold fury now. It may not be worth it. Sobex heading that way. Hebo's standing in the mid lane, but of course this could be a play to make sure that we don't go there. I have my blink. This is going to be a very risky play, but if it pays off, it may be worth it. They're going to get it. So they have fast enough clear, they're not. We're too worried. We're going to back off and play it safe. So now they're caught up, which is actually going to turn out to be a really good game. 21 to, or 22 to 16, but we're only about a you know 1,000, 1,400 gold apart, which is really, really great. This turned out to be a very fun game. Those damage numbers too strong. Nate's starting to catch up a bit, which is really good. Is there? I'm gonna stand here just the minion stay in the tornado. That should be enough. Those will end up dying. Fire giant about to respawn here. Fire giant's about about 30 seconds or so. If we push that too hard, so I'm just gonna come over here and farm. Very interesting play. We make sure we get as much damage off in this team fight as we can. Very strange play. This is going to be close. This 
is looking to be a very interesting team fight. Cupid's hanging out over here. Very well played. Very well played. There's a slow on the Evo as well as the Fenrir. Hercules is on his way. He's gonna eat the squall in the face. He's gonna dash away. Is it gonna save him? It will not. Free fire giant for us. Two players down. We're gonna get that. We can't really push in. They're gonna turtle up with uh, Subek, Fender, and Hebo. We can definitely go for the fire giant. We'll be all set. We'll be all set. Honestly, we just body block him. To return back to base. I'm actually going to go pretty greedy here and go for Polynomicon just for more damage. Biggest thing that we need right now. Lots and lots of damage. And you can see there in that team fight, once we pick someone off like that, I was kind of just waiting for Loki to go for the ult. Once I felt like he was about to pop the ultimate. Rupa, retreat. Retreat, Rupa. There's no reason for them to kind of be sitting around farming by themselves right now. As long as we group up, we'll be okay. All oh, will be well in the world. All oh, will be well in the world. On my way. Gold Fury should actually be respawning quite soon. Rupa. They're gonna be over here, over there. There's a ward. Shouldn't be anyone here just yet. I'm gonna put that down. We'll have vision. Once they group up, we'll be okay. That blue buff's probably not worth it right now. Again, we just want to stay together as long as we can. Look for a pick, we'll get the left side tower, and then we'll go. They don't know we have vision here. They may not have vision, they may. It looks like they're going to come out here. Oh. And what we can do is we can just go ahead and attack this tower. They could rotate behind us like they actually countered our ward. There's a rotation from the Hebro. The Hebro. Damage buff is up and available. I actually probably should have picked that up instead of the blue. I didn't think it was going to come up that soon. I thought it just got picked up. I just watch the enemy team right now. See where they're gonna go. Damage buffs on the ground. Damage buff on the ground. We need some more wards. We're pretty much just waiting for a pick right now, and that's why it seems like it's a lot of hurry up and wait. We're just waiting for something really big to happen. We get the team fight down. We'll push down the Phoenix, and everything will look good. Gonna hit the Fenrir. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. It's already off cooldown because I have cooldown cap because of my blue. That's gonna land on the Hebo. He's just gonna walk into it. It's about a fourth of his HP already. So back. Spear are gonna come out here. Kinda just waiting. This next engagement is going to determine a lot about the game. Loki's going to split push. So I'm just going to try to force this, it looks like. Push this down ourselves. I just I don't want to go back and clear that way, but I just kind of want to cut the feed of minions that the right lane's getting, and we'll be able to split push all lanes at once. It's gonna be a really good goal for us. Just be able to split push everything. Once we have that, the kid can't defend all phoenixes at once, and we'll have enough damage to just clear it out. 
That right lane looks like it's pushing up. There's going to be a tornado to clear that one out. Push it back in. That's going to clear it out. So this right lane should be catching up pretty soon. Loki left lane going to force that, that Phoenix to low HP. Let's see if we can't catch this on the way out again. It's already missed it. Loki had to ultimate away, which means he doesn't have that assassinate available. I'm going to back off there and just group up. That should clear that out pretty easily. There goes all that golden experience. Experience is worthless right now, but it's something. So now that right lane is going to catch up. I want to attack the Sobek. I want to attack the Sobek. Wow. <laughs> Hercules is here. He's going to try and throw a rock. There it is. Not going to hit me because I'm cool and awesome. Everything about me is awesome. Go away. Go away. No. 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 I'm really cool. I'm really cool. I'm really cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. Woo wee! Alright, that was played pretty close to the best. We got some kills. Cupid ended up dying. Each aim it went down. Now we're gonna get a mana pot or a, a magic pot. We're gonna get that. We're gonna sell that. We're gonna pick that up and we're gonna go out. Oh man. Oh man. This turned out to be a really, really good game. I'm actually really pleased about how this game turned out. I want to pick up their damage buff as we possibly can. We can still wait the Gold Fury. We want to take the Gold Fury and defend the Fire Giant. By that, I mean that we don't really want to force the Fire Giant unless we get a pick. They're back up and available. Ooh, that's a downer. That is a major downer. That's a major downer. Okay, that that's that's a derp. That's a derpy derp 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 derp. Not pleased about that, but hopefully he gets back in. We'll get to continue this awesome game. They could be doing Gold Fury, Gold, Gold, Gold Fury, which is probably where they were, honestly. I don't see any reason for them not to be there. Don't see any reason for them not to be there. Hercules is here. Fox is going in there. Farron looks like he wants to go in. Hebo from behind. He's going to take a lot of damage from me. A lot of damage. Good pick. Good pick. They're fighting for it. They're fighting for it. An ally has been slain. There's a slow. Tornado coming up soon. I don't know if we can do the fire giant right now. Loki gone. We have a death. We effectively have three players. They have... Four, which is unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. This is a tough one. We basically just need to ward this up and be careful. Don't look at me like that. Don't, don't, don't look at me like that. They had this warded. He's back! Nice job. You rock. Thank you. You like rock. Be careful. 
Alright, Herc is going to come down this way. Ignore Sobek. Ignore Sobek. Oh, we got outplayed. Man, I got zoned really hard. They went on the Hercules. Herc and Sobek need to be ignored. Oh. Ignore Sobek and Herc. Kill Hebo and Cupid. First and always. Cupid and Hebo. Cupid and Hebo, Cupid and Hebo, Cupid and Hebo. That's pretty much how it works. Cupid and Hebo. Ignore everybody else. Retreat. Yeah, that was just a tough spot to be in. That was really hard. Um, Cupid rotated, so Becky ro rotated on the backside. We still have the gold lead. They're going to get Fire Giant, most likely. I don't think there's anything we really can really do about that. Um, they're just going to get free Fire Giant. But, of course, with the respawn times and the fact that we still have three towers, three Phoenixes up, we're not that bad. So we're doing okay. We're doing okay. We're going to try and respawn as much as we can. Get out there, get back to the battlefield, and defend up our fields of justice. And just be really careful. I'm going to put up as many wards as I possibly can, get the vision on the mini-map. The Fire Giant should be down by now. I don't know any reason why they wouldn't want to take the Fire Giant after a victory like that. The damage buff is actually still up, surprisingly enough. We're going to come over here and put a ward down inside the Fire Giant, just to be sure. On the vision there, they rotate through. Yeah, that tower needs to be defended. The tower needs to be defended. So they're going to do Gold Fury, that's fine. Gold Fury is not as important anymore. Just let it go. The gold fury, they're gonna two man it. I'm gonna pour up a ward right here. Because they're probably gonna join their teammates pretty soon. Ignore Sobek and and Herc. We just need to assassinate them, like honestly. That is all their damage. Cupid and Hebo is all their damage. Cupid Hebo. They have Fire Giant buff. They don't have to pressure this. They can wait. They can, you know, kind of just control the map and get some farm, get some buffs. Um, everybody in the game is level 20 now, so this is going to be the late game. These team fights are so very important. Should have hit the Cupid. Looks like it is. Look at the damage that Cupid takes. He's just a big squish ball. Those hearts heal him so much, though. Wow. That was about a fifth or a sixth of his HP per heart. Really strong. A mighty Let me make sure that gets cleared out. I don't know if he's going to go in on this or not. Retreat. Getting frisky. Everyone's getting frisky. Be right back. Everyone's getting frisky. Those heals from Cupid are just turning out turning out to be too much. Too much. Too much sustain. Oh man. They are just holding on to this. 
Fallen out of this. That's what we needed. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god. This game has proven to be the end as we know it. Oh god. Hebo can wreck me right now. So that's important to keep in mind. Kind of standing behind other people. He wants to charge me. Oh god, it's gonna hurt. He wants it. 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 Woo wee! No, 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 no. Oh man, ah, this is a challenge. The farming, the farming needs to stop. No more farming. It's 55 minutes. Buffs and camps are meaningless. Man. This is a tough one. This is a tough one. Can we win is the question. We're still ahead. The fire giant has respawned. I'm going to be the last one to respawn here. They're going to be ahead now with these two towers and probably about 91,000 or so. Yeah, there's 91,700. Uh, so about 2,000 gold up now. He needs to... Oh my god. Oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Defend the Loki. Defend the Loki. Defend the Loki. Oh, you better, you better, you better, you better invisible yourself away, bro. Come on, brother. Come on, brother. This could be it. This could be, this could be the one. There you go. Playing some housekeeping here. Fenrir, oh, that's a great pick. There, oh, 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 they're gonna get Neath. Run, girl. Gonna go. There's a he brother. Like that's not gonna do anything. Not gonna do anything. Ow! Yeah, man. Retreat, retreat. Loki, Loki, you're crazy, dude. Loki, no. Loki, way too aggressive. Way too aggressive. God, that was freaking like Bruce Willis. This is in the movies. This is in the movies, man. Bruce Willis dies in real life. No one can crawl through air ducts with a broken leg. It's a very well-known and notable terrorist organization. Hope to survive. Man. 
Man. Well played. Well played. They picked me. Exactly what they need to do to win. Unless we got something. No. 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 There we go. Defend it. Defend it. Defend it. Defend it. Oh, the backflip. Oh, God. Oh, Hebo. Water cannon. Oh, he missed it. He missed the water spout. There's the ultimate. There's the rock. There's the dude. Good corn. Just. 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 Oh, I have to pee. I have to pee. And this game won't end. I, I got to Loki. Okay, the slow. Loki. Loki, you walked right by him. You walked by your dying teammate. You walked by him. Oh. Oh yeah, there you go. See? How hard was that? How hard was that? Not very. All right. All right. 2k behind. We're 2k behind. We're crossing over the hour mark. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. God, we're gonna make it. We're gonna do it. Alright, gold theory is up, but who cares? Honestly, I just bought a 3,000 gold potion because YOLO. Why not? Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Alright. 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 down. Again, who cares? They just want Loki. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Oh man! Oh man! Oh my god! I really must. Oh my god! I'm not drinking my legs right now because I don't want a big team fight accident to happen. Then none of that was a team fight. That was just exchanging blows. I'm gonna pop my my uh, elixir for a potion. For those of you that are frustrated right now, I am not using my potion for a specific reason. Reason being, there has been no team fight yet. It's just kind of people throwing, throwing abilities at each other, and I don't want to get picked off and lose the, the potion this early on in the game, or I guess this early on into the late, late, late game. So is doing such a great job of zoning right now. Such a great job. That, what? What? A mighty fall! I did not want to use my Aegis there. I did not want to use my Aegis there. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. I really must. Your right Phoenix is under attack. I should be clear, I'm gonna push both these lanes simultaneously. Push up. I might be right. Attack. 
No. We need as much vision as we can, though. I don't want anything here. I want something there. I don't want anything there. I want something there. No, 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 no. Give me this. Give me this. Give me that. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, me, me, me. Yes. Very much. 1145 magic damage. That's what we're doing right now. We're about to drop the Spirit's Tempest down on a 64 minute game of depression. Oh my god. Alright, we can do this. So back, go away. So back, stop it. This sub is doing such a great job. Yes! Get some of that justice! Come at me, dude! Come at me! Oh, God. Oh, God, he's got me. He came at me. He's following instructions. We're in trouble, 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 we're in trouble. Please, 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 don't throw a rock, don't throw a rock, me, 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 so that was my contribution to that team fight. Holy Jesus. Okay, so, recap. Two for one exchange. Cupid got one shot by the Spirit's Tempest. Fenrir ended up dying. I died because they want my nutsack and I don't like it. 4v4 right now. Oh my god. They can do fire giant. They can do fire giant. They can do fire giant. They can definitely do fire giant. Everyone's back off right now. Cupid's in base. Cupid's a squishy, squish, 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 squish. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Just, just, just. Yes. Two, one. Me. Potion. Yes. More wards. Wards are great. Dragging the noodle. Dragging the noodle across the ground, leaving the big trail. Oh my God. This game. Could be ours. It's 43, 34, 87. We got the, gold, the fire giant. We're behind in gold. But at this point, gold is absolutely meaningless. Nothing matters right now but team fights. Kill the Hebo and the Cupid and be very careful. Don't dive. Just go. Just go away. Go away. Don't like you. No one's ever going to love you. You're alone in life and in death because you're a crocodile. May as well become a movie theater. Because that's what you're for. I'm sorry, that was me. I apologize. Sobek, you've been doing such an incredible job of zoning, man. Number one tank, 2013. 2013. <laughs> Hebo Cupid! That's all it is. That's all it is. That's what it comes down to. That's what it is. That's what... You know what it is. Everything I do, I kill Cupid. And Hebo. Oh my god. Is this game still going? Is this game... Oh jeez. This is all going to come down to one fight. Maybe. The respawn times are pretty high. If we can win this fight, we can win the game right now. If we can win this fight, we're going to win this game right now. Hebo Cupid. Hebo Cupid. Hebo Cupid. Hebo Cupid. Oh, that's a tongue twister. Ah! 
Mate! So Hebo basically just traded himself for probably our biggest damage dealer. Absolutely our biggest damage dealer. Can they clean it up? Can they clean it up? Come on! Come on! Team! 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 Ah! Best team ever! Best team ever! Number one team! Number one team! Loki! 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 Reset, reset, reset. Reset, reset. Talk. Oh, come on, come on, come on. 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 We're gonna get that. We're gonna get that. We're gonna get this. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. Alright. Alright. So. Still, still can't push in. I think this is also a big result of the respawn timers and the new fire giant. I'm gonna get damage buff because I've earned it and I'm awesome. Fire giant's not gonna respawn for a little bit. The worshippers this game, I swear. They're doing gold theory, which I don't know why. Which we could collapse on them. No, they're not going to do gold theory. So big. Oh god. I just need to sit like like super duper 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 far back. They cannot initiate on me. That is their their way of winning this game. If they initiate on me and kill me before I can do my truckloads of damage, they have a really good chance of winning the team fights. If they don't, and they've been doing it all game, is they really just want to dive me as hard as they can and jump on me and get the kill. This is 71 minutes, my god. This is a story of a girl. That Phoenix should be able to defend itself. The means will be respawning soon. No, 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 no. No, Neath, no! It'll push itself back. It's fine. It's fine. This team fight is everything. It's everything I ever wanted. It's everything I ever wanted. So I'm going to sit back here. Basically, if I don't have to squint to see them, I'm too close. Because Hebo just traded himself for me. He knew it. He just wanted me to die because I do lots of damage. He really relied on his team. I'm going to let Bacchus go in on this one. Kind of just waiting, 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 waiting. Waiting. Right lane's pushing itself back, which is good. If they leave to push that, there's Loki. Spirit Arrow. Heap on the right side. Not today. Not today, Hebo. Not today. Dragon Strike. Sean Quay. Tornado. Hebo Cupid. Hebo Cupid. Hebo. Hebo Cupid. Hebo Cupid. We're just waiting. We're just waiting. We're just waiting. It's okay. Shh. Relax. 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 It's okay. Shh. Relax. Relax. They're waiting. Where's Hebo? That's what I want to know. We have vision on both sides. Oh god. They want it so very bad. Jesus Christ! Freaking god dang it, dude! Kill them! Kill them! God dang it, dude! God dang it, dude! Freaking god! It's simple. We kill the dry bear. We kill the dry bear. Oh my jeez. Oh my jeez. Oh my jeez. Oh my god. I tried to Aegis and didn't go off in time. I tried to blink afterwards and go off in time. They just like 
Ragnarok, Hercules, Hebo, Sobek. They f three or four ultied me. And Loki's trying to brawl. Loki's trying to ball. I'm trying to brawl. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, dude. They know they just have to kill me. They know they kill me, they win. They kill me, they win. That's really what it comes down to now. They kill me, they win. And they know it. They obviously know it. There's a kill on the Fenrir. I'm gonna pick up this damage buff because nobody's here to fight. I was so far back. God, they want my nuts. They just, they just want them. Oh my god. We can totally do this. We can totally do this. Like, we got this. We, we got this. How is Neath not done with her items? Come on, Neath. You can do this. We can win this game. We can win this game, dude. Like, I have nothing to do. There's nothing to do. There's nothing to do. Don't attack Fire Giant. Hercules is left, yes. Oh, do we have the vision? I don't know if we have the vision. Oh, just do it, 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 do it. Quickly. 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 There you go. Just for you, Hebo. There you go! There you go! Hebo dude! Hebo dude! That's what I'm talking about! That's what I'm talking about! That predict tornado into Loki just freaking just Minotaur! Murder Minotaurs! That's exactly that's exactly they all lined up for me. It's like freaking King Prince. We're doing the work that Jesus intended. This is what he wanted. Oh, God. There's a slow. I'm gonna get. Phoenix is down. Just do it. 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 Hit him in the face. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it not gonna end? It's not gonna end. It's not gonna end. It's not gonna end. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. Leave me alone. Leave the dragon alone. Leave the dragon alone. Just leave me freaking just live. God freaking jerk. God damn it. Oh my god, dude, please. It's 77 minutes. Why? God damn it. Come on. An ally has been slain. Okay. Alright. Alright. We can do this. We can freaking. We can freaking do this. We can do this, god dang it. We can do this. Oh god. Oh Loki! Get the Cupid! Baby dies! Blue scars! Baby dies! Blue scars! God dang it, yes! Freaking just no, I don't even care! I don't even care! Just use the potion! Use the potion! This is important! This is important! Go, 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 go! Go, go, go! Oh, oh. Cupid, we got 40 seconds. Those respawn timers are too short. So much dirt! He's gonna be back in 50 seconds! Come on! Come on! Get the minotaur! Get the minotaur! Yeah, I should've bought Girdle. Should've freaking bought Girdle, dude. Double kill! Double kill! Double kill! Oh my god, dude! Just double kill! Double kill! Go. Go. Have a ward. I'm leaving a, bre a breadcrumb trail of wards to the enemy base. Oh god. They're gonna, they're gonna blink me. They're gonna blink me. They're gonna blink me, dude. They're gonna blink me. Sometimes you wanna go for frickin' evil shots his mouth. Just 
go. Just go. Kill the freaking. Just go, oh, Cupid. Not today. Not today. What do we say to Cupid? Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. No, 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 no. Screw it. Screw it. We're going for it. Yes! Freaking get. Oh, dude. 79 minutes. God, 79 minutes. Holy God. Holy God. I almost did 100,000 damage. I did 95,000 damage. Mother of God. The damage numbers. Oh. My. Yeah. Alright. How many worships did I get? I got 47 worshippers for that. 1600 experience. 177 favor. I know, 330 favor. Oh, God. Alright. I don't know what to say, guys. I hope you learned everything there is to learn about Smite ever. I'll see you in my, my next game.